Here I discovered the quaint hamlet of Ustenheim, now long abandoned and collapsing into ruin. Legend claimed that Janos Ordren terrorized its villagers until the Saraphan hunters ferreted him out and destroyed him. If there was any truth to the old tales, the lair of the infamous vampire must be far away. This edifice was clearly not crafted by human architects. As the figure beneath the balcony silently attested, these were the Ares of winged beings. Undoubtedly, I stood before the mountain refuge of the legendary Janos Ordren, but the entire sanctuary lay in ruin, collapsed under the force of some ancient cataclysm. As I suspected, the time streamer's deception ensured I was centuries too late to unearth anything of consequence here. With nothing behind me but the wasteland I had traversed, I resolved to press on 
and explore these canyons further. Oh no. Every time you turn up, something monumental and terrible happens. I don't think I have the stomach for it. <laughs> no drama this time, Brazier. You are persistent, crossing time like this to follow me. Still waiting for that coin of yours to land on its edge. I'm biding my time. I see that Mobius has played a little trick on you. Yes. He clearly doesn't want me to meet this Janos Audrin. Perhaps. Or maybe he merely hoped that it would harden your heart against me to see this wasteland which I single-handedly authored. My heart doesn't need hardening, King. If I even suspected that destroying you would make any difference, I would do it this instant. <laughs> I knew you'd see through them, Raziel. Janos is indeed the key to your destiny, but you'll need to find your own way back into Nosgoth's past. Make no mistake, though, Raziel. You and I are now in great danger. We are irritants here. Malevolent forces are being marshaled to eliminate us. You talk as though we're allies. Regardless of your sentiments, Raziel, in their eyes, we are. Well, they're certainly trying to eliminate you, King. There can be no doubt of that. I am assaulted relentlessly with demands for your demise. Whatever it is that you're plotting, they're scared to death of you. As for me, I suspect they made a grave error when they allowed my unique resurrection. I don't think they know how to destroy me. You mustn't underestimate them, Raziel. And who exactly is this diabolical they to which we keep referring? If there's some grand conspiracy going on, the right hand doesn't appear to know what the left is doing. Even Mobius seems to be caught out at every turn. Mobius is a puppet, Raziel. Haven't you realized that yet? That's the sweetest irony in all of this. Nosgoth's great manipulator is their plaything. But the ones pulling the strings haven't shown their faces yet. They don't like us unwriting their carefully choreographed history, though, do they? You must understand, Razio, we haven't unwritten history, we've merely rewritten it. The future flows around our petty actions, finding the path of least resistance while admitting only the slightest alterations. This is the reshuffling you felt when you refused to kill me. And remember, Raziel, we are irritants in this regard as well. History will not allow the introduction of a paradox. And if events cannot be reshuffled to accommodate the change? It is the irritant who's expelled. Bear in mind, this may be exactly the outcome our enemies are trying to prevent. We must tread very carefully.